know how all those influencers have those really cute boho minimalist white furniture rooms um, that look very neat and great well uh, my room is the exact opposite of that hello everyone and welcome to my room it's the most beautiful time of the year and i decided to take you with me to decorate on a budget i will show you how to do it even if you have a very weird room like mine is look at that that's totally random that doesn't make any sense what's that cat doing there i don't know so anyways put on your cozy pajamas and grab a cup of coffee or a cup of tea or a bottle of wine i really don't care and let's get to decorating Woo! so one thing you have to keep in mind when you're watching decorating youtube videos is that well all youtubers homes are meant to be aesthetically pleasing because they are filming all the time so of course when your house looks like this well it's super easy to make it look very pretty when you're decorating for christmas but when it looks like mine where well, it's not as aesthetically pleasing as it should be you know but that's okay because the whole point of decorating your room is to make you feel cozy to make you feel at home to make you feel like you belong to that place so as long as you put your touch and use a little bit of your creativity you are going to be doing just fine also i know i told you to change into your favorite pajamas but i have something even better just the best ugly christmas t-shirt you've ever seen you are not ready for this do you love it isn't this like the most amazing shirt you have ever witnessed this is the very ugly looking bag as you can see it has this very cute cat first of all but uh, i was talking about the cute wintery christmas themed uh shits this is really nice and this cat is really nice i love her so much you are my love the love of my life i love you baby so in order to start our christmas decorating we have to go through that door to the attic and that's where we keep our christmas stuff i think one very important thing when decorating your room is deciding on a theme and sticking to it as you can see i already have this wood going on on the walls and so i kind of want to bring like the nature inside a little bit of wood like these rusty colors um i don't know they really make me feel cozy and uh, comfortable so that's what i will go for but you can go with whatever matches your furniture this not christmasy enough i just grabbed some tea from the kitchen luckily i had this one that is really christmasy and i really like it uh and uh, since it was open i just found a cute bow that i had from a present and i am going to attach it like this and put it in a tray oh my god i found something even better i forgot i had this um these are literally hooks and i bought them for name tags to put on gifts but it would be really cute to put one on this tea bag and write what tea this is right i think it's gonna be cute let's try it let's try it so it comes with this solid water chalk i decided to leave um this uh, giraffe here just because it's tall and it looks good on this huge ass wall um, and I will just decorate it for Christmas so um, I'm putting this uh, Christmas tree bow on it and uh, let's see what else goes on it so cute so as I said I want more of a nature vibe inside the house so I thought well I have to get a plant so I got this very Christmassy plant I don't know the name of it I really don't have a green thumb but somehow I managed to change the pots and now it looks really pretty um, and I also got this basket, but I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it in here. So let's see if it works or not. Got suction hooks and also this very nice colored ribbon. And I am thinking of putting it there, like whoop, 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 whoop. If that makes sense, we shall see. Look at this mess. Okay, the only issue is I paid very little on this, so I am not sure if they're good enough to stick. Ah, that's promising so since my plan doesn't work i thought of using that really cute ribbon here since my bedding is also red i guess it works okay this was very complicated to film with one hand but uh, you get it just twist it around um it's not rocket science yes and then just stick it with some scotch on the inner side so you can't really see it from the room here you can see i just decided to change the books i had which were very colorful for a little bit more like um 
toned down ones, I guess. And this is the only like Christmas book I could find. So uh, I just added that in there. This is actually a very funny book. Totally read this. It has real... Oh my god! Oh my god! Did you see what just happened? Did you see that? From there, bumped on this, fell here. Let's see. Oh my god, please, 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 don't be broken, please. Oh my god. <gasps> Another great tip is just buying a shit ton of fairy lights, as you can see. Um, those need to be plugged in, but these are on battery, which is amazing, because you can put them literally anywhere. And it's so, it, it just makes everything so much better. Love it. Very Christmassy. I just decided to keep the international team and add some um, decorations I got from Poundland in the UK. These are from Poundland. These are actually from a post office in the UK, but I got them in February, uh, which means they were like two pounds instead of like 14 pounds. <laughs> so that was a great deal. And I'm glad I kept them for a whole year. So uh, another tip is, of course, just wrapping empty boxes or even books. Wrap them up in some really nice um, wrapping paper that works with whatever you want to do in your room and um, it's going to look fabulous I just took this random vase from uh, downstairs um, it was just hidden in a corner and to make it look Christmassy we are going to add, you know, Christmas tree decorations a great hack Here's another tip, actually I've done this a few days ago so I didn't think about filming the before but this wall was really really ugly and empty and it had a lot of cracks and marks and it was weird so I just decided to take some window stickers, yes these are actually those stickers that you can stick on your window but uh, instead I put them on the wall and uh, it turned out really really nice and I really like this That was it, that took literally like half of the day but it's finally done on my ass tonight. Everyone's silent. Listen to my t-shirt talk. 